Hello, sports fans. Welcome to Wager Wednesday. And let's recap last week, week 13. I did the best I've done so far. I won 12 2, and thank you, New York and Washington, and won. The only losses I had, the Chiefs. Yeah, that was kind of an upsetting game, but a good fought game. And I lost the Chargers, which didn't really care. But, hey, Aaron Rodgers can't beat many teams this year, but he still owns the Bears. Now, the tie, really Washington and New York, for those of you that watched that, is it just me or did neither team really give a crap in the last four minutes? They didn't even try, it seemed like. It was disappointing. A really good game was the Buccaneers on Monday night. Wow, what a finish. Still hate Tom Brady. And Lamar Jackson, my fantasy quarterback. Get your knee together. Your act is fine. Get your knee together. Now, let's go on to week 14. And by the way, last week, that means obviously I won my upset pick which was the Steelers over the Falcons. I won against Vegas, and I beat Vegas again. And the hot sauce pick was the Ravens over the Broncos. It was a squeaker in the last minute, but they did it. So, this week, week 14, I have for my picks. First and foremost, the Rams will beat the Raiders. Yeah, enough said. I do have the Bengals beating the Browns, because if they can beat the Chiefs, they can flush the Browns. You take them Browns to the Super Bowl, see how far it gets you. I do have the Ravens, with or without, we don't know yet, Lamar Jackson, I still have them beating the Steelers. Now I have the Titans over the Jaguars, which ought to be a really good game. The Cowboys I have over the Texans, because again, they're the Texans do have the Bills beating the Jets. Should happen. Who knows who's going to quarterback the Jets. Maybe it's Flacco this week. Why not? Alrighty, now. I do have the Vikings as my hot sauce pick over the Detroit Lions. That's right, last straps baseball. Freddy, got your Lions to lose. My upset pick of the week, I'm going against Vegas. I do have the Giants. To upset the Eagles. I think it can happen as long as it's not a tie game toward the end. I do have the Chargers beating the Dolphins because Tua is just a pretender. I have the Seahawks beating the Panthers, which could happen, and now I guess Baker Mayfield's a free agent. They mutually agreed to release him. Uh, the Buccaneers I have beating the 49ers because who's going to quarterback the 49ers? I mean, come on, really, Mr. Fuego, are you going to move and start quarterbacking for San Fran? Uh, I do have the Chiefs beating the Broncos. This is the first time this year they met and they played two divisional games against them a year. This is really late for the Chiefs and Broncos to have their first meeting of the year. So the Chiefs are going to win. And next Monday night, I have the Cardinals beating the Patriots. We'll see if Mac Jones can get his temper under control. We can see if Kyler Murray can get his head out of his center's butt and have a good game. I have the Cardinals winning fair and square. There it is. There's my picks. Take it to the bank. And you know what, guys? Thank you for indulging me. Thank you for watching my videos. Tune into all of my lovely videos, including Saturday morning cartoons, Sunday shout-outs, and every now and then we get a little wacky and do a three-pack battle. Hey, guys. Peace out. Cheers up. Have a good rest of your Wednesday. Have a great week. I'll catch you on the flip side. All right? All right.